Would you date a plus size person? My name is Trey. Welcome to What Kind of Change. Today we're going to be talking about plus size dating. If you want to like and subscribe after watching this video, please do. If not, that's cool. We're working our way towards a PC soundboard. So if you want to help, you can donate right here. We love you. We appreciate you. All right. So let's go ahead and get into this video. This is from a TikToker named 11 ESPI. Appreciate you for putting these videos up. It's, it's a great conversation for us to have. What are you calling my phone for? Go back to the bitch you love so much. What are you calling my phone for? Go back to the bitch you love so much. Now, the reason I put this first video up is because she talks about when you know he's the guy that only wants to hook up with plus size girls but not seriously date them. Now, a lot of people say she looks great and all that kind of stuff. That's fine. But we're going to see kind of what uh, her body looks like. Let's watch this so first video. Would you date someone who's plus size? Um, I mean, uh, I mean, yeah. Uh, yeah, probably. I mean, I guess it I kind of it kind of depends like 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 how much because like if it's like too much then it's kind of a problem, but like to their to their life then 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 probably not, but if it's like they can still like live their lives and it's like you know they can just it's just normal for them then i i mean probably if i like them what's too much just to the point where it's like they like it just affects what they can do and like i have to like like um like change my my life for them give to give a visual am i too much um be honest um be honest I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know how you live your life, so I don't know, like... You... So it's how they live their life and not their size? I guess, yeah. Would you date someone who's... Play I want to go ahead and say that this whole thing is a paid sponsorship. Um, not every video, but towards the end, it's actually um, sponsored by at Woo. Uh, is it Woo Plus? I believe that's what the name of the dating site is. Woo Plus Curvy Dating or something like that. So there was a purpose to this whole video. We're going to watch another video of what the women have to say on this side, but I want to talk about his response first. When she said, what about me? Am I too much? And he said, that's a no. That's a no. The man was trying to be respectful. He was. He was trying to be like, listen, I, I don't know, but let me be honest with you guys. Uh, your personality only gets you so far, baby. It only gets you so far. She looks like a pretty big woman. Um, so I thought, I don't think he would date her, but that's okay. Right. Just like women would have their preferences. Most women don't want to really date a fat guy. Will they? Maybe if they fall in love or something like that or whatever people say. Yeah. But if we're talking about just looks, is she going to is she going to respond to somebody in the DMs who's attractive and looks great? Or are they going to respond to somebody who's in the DMs who's short and fat? Let's be honest. They're going to go with the person who's more conventionally attractive. If they, if two of the same guys were in the DM, but they both look different, she's going to go with the one who's more conventionally attractive to somebody who's plus size for what they want to say. And there's nothing wrong with that. You know, even me being a, oh, I never call myself plus size. I call myself fat. Um, I'm overweight, you know, once again, you know, I've been eating my, eat my bowls of fruit, doing the best I can. Right. Like I said, and it, it is, it's quite a journey. However, I realized that I'm probably going to be overweight for at least the next year or two, right? But uh, it, it's slowly coming down. But when I expect the female to be like, oh, yeah, Trey, I want you. Yeah, I know you're fat, but yeah, I, I think you got a great personality. Nope, I don't. You know, once again, when I got married, I'm going to be honest with you guys. My wife didn't really care about how big or small um, a guy is. If she liked them, she liked them. But that's not everybody. And that's fair because weight can become unhealthy the older you get it's cool to say i get with somebody plus size now but when you're 40 years old and they can't get out of the chair and their knees are breaking down and their body is starting to struggle and they're starting to have heart problems it's not so cool to be plus size at that point that's all we're saying right and so some people have to think about their future now could i get with a plus size person off of potential of course i could right I would, you know, it's crazy for me to, I've been with a girl who's bigger. I've been with a girl who's over 200 pounds and is bigger now today, as far as I know. So I understand that. And I was also bigger myself. So it's not a bad thing that if you're a person who's maybe, maybe not plus size, but you're just an average person. You got, average, you know, you're not maybe muscular, but you're, you're not fat. It's okay to say, no, I don't want to get with a plus size person. That's fine. 
And we should allow that. It, the good thing about her is she's not really pushing it. She's simply just asking questions. She's giving a little pushback, but she's not really pushing. I liked her video. I watched all of them, um, but she does a great job of just not really having to push too much of an agenda. What do you call Would you well, date? Except for this part. What are you part. calling my phone for? <laughs> Would you date someone who's plus size? No. <gasps> and why not? Because why don't you just work out? <laughs> do you go to the gym? Uh, no. Would y'all date someone who's plus size? Yes. Yeah, I would. What do y'all have to say to your friend here that wouldn't? I don't even know. I don't know. She's crazy. Like, are we talking like humongous or just like chubby? Someone the size of DJ Khaled. No. You would take DJ Khaled. Not him, but like, not him specifically, but like body, yeah. Dang. Like, what if they're a really nice person? Like, you fell in love with them. We could work out together. <laughs> When you have gone to the gym, have you seen people that are big there? No, they're like really fit. So I don't know, I haven't even seen those people. You've never seen a, a big person at the gym? No. Girl, you're, you act like your boyfriend's like six pack. I don't know, his height makes up for it. He's chubby. But we're talking about humongous. Wait, your boyfriend's plus size? Uh, he's chubby. He's not like, I don't know. Skinny, like skinny skinny. He's, he's like a little bit smaller than DJ Khaled. So whatever you consider plus size. <laughs> That part was pretty interesting. Um. <laughs> Would you date someone who's plus size? I knew I was going to replay. That's why I didn't talk. Okay. So the reason she asked that question, would you, have you ever seen a big person in the gym? Because some people would be like, I want somebody who works out. And then her argument is going to be, well, there are big people in the gym because I'm in the gym too. Uh, so, you know, it's not about going to the gym. But what people are really trying to say, and this is what they want you to read between the lines. If you're going, they're saying, please work out, do something for your health. Being overweight is not a good thing. But if she's saying literally that her boyfriend is a little bit smaller than DJ Kelly, that's pretty big. DJ Kelly is a pretty big man, right? We've seen DJ Kelly. We've seen him with his shirt off. He's pretty big. He hasn't lost weight in a long time as far as I've seen him, unless he recently did it. Because you know how celebrities, the, you'll see a picture of them uh, yesterday and they're 300 pounds. You'll see a picture of them today and they're in the gym and they're muscular like what happened from day one to day two? Like how? And they'll be like, oh, man, I've been working for the last year. It's like I just saw a picture of you live. I just saw a video of you live yesterday live streaming and you were overweight. How are you? <laughs> um, but uh, back back to the subject. <laughs> to be honest with you guys, I'm glad that she would say something like that. Now, does it make sense if her boyfriend is a little smaller than DJ Kelly? Um, I think she thinks she's being a little disingenuous. Um but once again, I think people should have their preferences. The guy that you saw in the first video, the guy who was standing next to her, you can go back and watch. He also makes a video. I'm not going to show all six parts, but he says he says he would not date a girl who is plus size. And the reason he said was because he goes to the gym. And then she asked him, well, uh, have you ever seen a big person at the gym? And he goes, yes. He goes, so big people do go to the gym. And that that was the end of the video. Uh, no, that is not the same thing. A big person going to the gym does not mean I now have to date them. I don't care if they got potential. I don't care what they're doing, right? If you have a preference, you have a preference. And that's okay, right? Um, and for what she said before, when she said plus size women, they tend to get hooked up with. Yeah. That's how it goes. That's how men are. Do I agree with it? Of course I don't. I don't agree with men going out and just having random stuff with random strangers however i have to you know i have to use my common sense here men are going to have relations and intimacy well, i wouldn't call it intimacy they're going to have relations with anybody they want right if they can get it they're going to take it that's just how we've been pro we're well, not programmed but we've been kind of told that's how it goes for us men we get told that our status goes up with the more women we can have whether she's big or small they don't care Right. As long as you're getting something, it makes your status go up for some odd reason. But I would say, man, there's nothing wrong with somebody who doesn't want to date a plus size person. If you got a great personality, good luck to you. Um, that's fine. But your options will open up a lot if you lose more weight. I promise you, some women and some men, they just get people simply because they're not obese. I'm going to be honest with you. Some people get in relationships simply because they're in shape. They, they automatically go up the totem pole just not being overweight. I know some people hate that. They want you to get to know them. But I'm fine with that. If somebody looked just like me but was 100 pounds less, 
and he got more girls than I could, I'm perfectly fine with that. It's all part of life, man. Life isn't fair, right? And I don't think it's fair for you. I want to say this. I don't think it's fair for a plus size person to be like, oh, you got to take me even though I'm plus size. Why? If you don't look like I want you to look, how come I got to take you, but you wouldn't just take any other guy? Like, she's a plus size girl. As far as I know, she's not married. So is she just picking up any guy who's plus size? She's just dating any guy because of how he looks? Her first video said, go away from me. Go back to the girl you like. So that sounds like a girl who's picky to me, right? So I don't think she just picks any plus size man. I don't think she's just going to pick any guy. And that's her right. That's her. That's fine. Now, are you going to get less outcomes if you do that? Of course. Right. But that's life. You got to pick and choose your poison. You know, which route you want to go one way or another. But you're going to you got to pay the cost either way. Either way. Anyway, let me know what y'all think. Would y'all date a plus size person? Mm.